What do North Korean hackers and a tropical fruit have in common? More than you might think, thanks to a new malware variant called Durium. But don't be fooled by its fruity name. This malware is no joke. Uh, according to a report by cybersecurity firm Kaspersky, Durian is being used by the North Korean hacking group Kim Suki to target South Korean cryptocurrency firms. Uh, this new strange malware acts as an installer, uh, deploying a, a steady stream of malware, including a backdoor known as Appleseed and a custom proxy tool called Lazy Load. Uh, but uh, how is Durian getting into these crypto firm systems in the first place? Uh, the hackers are exploiting uh, legitimate security software uh, that is used exclusively by uh, these firms in South Korea. This type of persistent attack is becoming increasingly common as hackers look for new ways to gain access to sensitive information. Uh, one interesting note is that Lazy Load has also been used by Andarial, a subgroup within the notorious North Korean hacking group Lazarus. This tenuous connection has some experts wondering if Kinsuki and Lazarus are working together. And speaking of Lazarus, this group has made headlines in the past for their high-profile hacks and exploits. In fact, according to independent blockchain sleuth Zach XBT, Lazarus successfully laundered over $200 million in ill-gotten crypto between 2020 and 2023. And in total, the group is accused of stealing over $3 billion in crypto assets in the six years leading to 2,000 pounds to every one feast. So the next time you hear about a striking new malware variant, don't be so quick to dismiss it as just another tech headline. With hackers becoming more sophisticated from every day, it's important to stay vigilant and protect yourself and your information. With that said, thanks for watching. And until next time.